Okay, let's uh, talk. Let's go to back to Dr. Llewellyn because you said, Dr. Llewellyn, that uh, that we don't get enough chromium. I mean, excuse me, selenium, and we don't get enough magnesium. What else? What happens as a result of not getting those um, miner- uh, minerals, sir? Well, first of all, uh, tremendous. I mean, Professor Yops can really tell you, but I will tell you from a clinical point of view or research point of view. The magnesium is essential for every cell functioning in your body. That's 100 trillion cells. And most emotional diseases or conditions, um, most dementia, and a lot of the modern diseases that we get, uh, uh, which mix with um, brain interactions, these are magnesium deficiencies. They're not very clever it's very simple if the body has the magnesium it works with it with your selenium if you don't have it your immune system will run down and that's where very serious diseases that i doubt if there's more than 90 well certainly 99 percent of most cancers you'll find that selenium patient deficient and we know absolutely on the web that selenium will help tremendously rectify the immune system to fight the cancer. There are about eight or nine forms of chemical selenium, none of which are found in nature, in the plants or in the animals that eat the plants and we eat the animals. None of those. Our bodies don't deal with them. And again, look at the back of the label. You'll see L-selenomethionine. You'll see sodium selenate, sodium selenite. Sodium selenite, by the way, in the literature is known to cause cancer but it's sold as a selenium supplement. L-selenomethionine is another big one sold in America, and I will tell you that, A, that that form just doesn't appear in nature, and our bodies don't use it. All right, so what you're saying is, and I know from the U.K. perspective now, or the EU directive perspective, is that you all are having to really compress down into one item or one tablet or one whatever the um, the real um, power behind the supplement because you're not going to have it in the quantity that you used to have. Uh, That's me... right. And people say to me, you know, you support supplements, um, and Professor Yops will tell you much more on this. You support supplements. Aren't you angry that the, go- the governments of Europe are c- crushing down on all these supplements? I say, no, I'm absolutely delighted. People's health would improve because we're not filling them with toxic chemicals. And incidentally, the the sort of things that you're talking about, these proper food structure nutrients, they are actually listed as foods, not as chemicals. All right, so what you're saying is we have to compress it down to get the real oomph behind it, I mean the real strength behind these. Yes, I think one American professor once said to me, with these, you get more slam per gram, which I thought was rather amusing. <laughs> That's very good. That's kind of what I was trying to get to. Yeah, I thought and, you were. Yes. And you should ask Dr. Yops about his clinical experience. And I will do that because Professor Yops is joining us right now. He is an integrative medicine physician, uh, the kind of physician that we really, really like on, this, on the Power Hour program. Mm-hmm.